the magic of Siam Reap. His evaluator oh. is DTM support, who also joined Toastmaster in Thai Airways. I met him. So he will be the one who tell us about the purposes of this speech. I send the, the evaluation form in the chat box. Could you please see that? Or you can see from agenda, please. Hi, thank you so much. I'm very happy because I saw a lot of your picture about Siem Reap, but I don't have anything that you sent me. So can anybody read it for me, please? Okay, so we can. Tomatata, could you please help to read the purposes of my project? The project? In the agenda, you can see that. Agenda. I don't see the agenda in my... In my um... Okay, please wait. Okay, for the yeah. purpose, okay. for the purpose, for the purpose of DTM to know so a lot, Presentation mastery introduced or reveal basic presentation software strategy for creating and using slides to support or enhance a speech. Yes, the purpose is introduce or reveal basic presentation software strategies for creating and using slides to support to enhance a speech. Back to you. Thank you, thank you. Uh, this, uh, Genia, you want to say something, please? Is this the right purpose for you or your purpose is you're practicing or selecting and using a variety of visual aids during a speech? It, uh, almost the same, yes. It's the same project, yes. Thank you. So this is an elective project in level three. Thank you, Genia. So now, Toastmaster Tanu, the magic of Siam Reap, the magic of Siam Reap, Toastmaster Tanu. Now I wear another hat as a speaker. <laughs> so timekeeper, could you please time me from now on? Thank you. Do you believe in magic? For me, I do believe in magic. Toastmaster of the day, fellow members and honorable guests. I just came back from Siem Reap last weekend and I found that it confirmed my belief that magic can happen. So let me share with you this slide. One minute. When I was in Siem Reap, I witnessed a few things that confirm my belief in magic. Five years ago, in 2017, I went to Siem Reap because of my student introduced me to a professor. His name is Dr. Min Soti on the right hand. And I met him at a university called the Southeast Asia University in Siem Reap. The biggest one in Siem Reap is a private university and we talk we discussed about building a new club, Toastmasters Club in Siem Reap. And I went back. And on the left is Uncle Wat, you may know, the seventh wonder of the world. So I think to myself that I just planted a seed of Toastmasters in the soil of Siem Reap. I don't know, there will be a tree growing up or not. But amazingly, last weekend, last weekend that I mentioned to you that I just came back. Our district leaders, four of us, 
including me, DTM Lin, the program quality director, DTM Pipat, the public relation manager, and DTM Venus, a retention club chair, and myself. We, we have been there to conduct an open house for CM Reap because CM Reap is building a new club. You see, five years still in my mind. And we have met some kind of magic during our event. We met a speaker, a professional speaker who stay at the same hotel. So we met during our breakfast. We never know him before, but we have a small talk and discuss about what we are doing in Siem Reap. And then we know that he was available in the afternoon when we have the event open house. So we invited him to join us. He accepted because the hotel and the university not very far, just 200 meters walk. His name is Richard Young. If you Google, you will find him. He is also a TED Talk speaker. He described himself as a futurist, a futurist, the one who knows the future probably. He, he author books and you can find in the Google to search more. And after he joined our event, he's so happy to see the energy of the audience, the young people in Siem Reap. So he offered, I asked him, could you please be our charter member of Siem Reap Toastmaster to leave a legacy there? He said, why not? And he used to be a Toastmaster in Seattle, USA, many years ago. So he know what Toastmaster can do for the youth of Cambodia. And more than that, he offers some scholarship for four female, female young, youngster in Siem Reap to be the member. He want to sponsor half of the fee and let the student pay another half for four female, he mentioned clearly. But he want to help people in Cambodia. So I feel very grateful and I consider this is one of the magic happened. We never know this before. And in the, in the, the event, I was the keynote speaker, speak for only five to seven minutes, the very short keynote speech. And it is the first keynote speech in my life that called keynote speech. I never do that before, I never did that. And my topic is about the most dangerous place in the world. But today I will not share with you the content. It's just about, I talk about myself, how I move out of my own comfort zone, which I consider the most dangerous place for me in the world. So that is another magic. Guess what? person that I just mentioned that I met say uh, five years ago in 2017 on the left. I want to meet him again. So I try to contact him, but it's not easy to contact him because he is now the president of the university. But finally I managed to meet him before I leave. And we have a talk, a good talk again about the new club in Siem Reap. And I think this one is another magic that you make sure that Siem Reap Toastmaster will be born definitely because of this leadership in the university and American corner. So we are so happy about this. So how about you? Have you ever witnessed some kind of magic like this in your life? In conclusion, my lesson learned from this trip, I believe magic can happen to anyone. And we have to do something like this, plant a seed every day. A seed.
second in the real seat. In, in my case, it's a seat of Toastmasters. You can build, you can put any seat in the soil according to your passion. So that is how magic happen. If you don't do anything, magic will never happen. So that is what I would like to conclude my speech. Think about yourself. How can you make your magic happen in your life? Thank you for listening. Back to you, Toastmaster of the day. <laughs>